Wright coming to you live from San Francisco in Kubacan. I'm here with Rob Sumsky. Rob, how are you? Really good. How are you doing? I'm doing well. So you're an early employee of CoreOS. What, what are you doing there now? I lead our experience design team. So we work on all of the uh, web interfaces that we ship, uh, some of our websites and documentation, as well as some uh, command line tools like etcd CTL and Fleet CTL and that type of thing. I remember now, maybe, gosh, two years ago, huge buzz on CoreOS. Um, I don't think it had been, at least in my mind, people weren't connecting it to containers, but it was sort of one of those things that you needed to really, if you were a cool kid, you had to know about it. Can you talk about the early days? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, containers came around at just the right time where um, we're starting to talk about an operating system uh, designed for uh, large-scale clusters and to get the applications on there and have them uh, kind of in a pseudo-multi-tenant environment, uh, containers and Docker came around at just the right time for us to kind of make this type of operating system work. Um, and so we've kind of been riding that wave um, and then trying to invent um, some new technologies and where we see gaps in the marketplace and that type of thing. So were you one of the, so would you would say you're the original one of those, what do you call, skinny OSs? I think you, uh, Alex yeah, said we like to say we invented the micro OS um, and we're really flattered that some of the other folks, uh, some of the big heavy hitters in tech have kind of uh, validated our business model and kind of our, uh, you know, the way we built this technology. So now you guys obviously are more than just CoreOS at this point. You've, you've expanded, you've got Rocket, you've got Tectonic. Can you explain what, what those are? Yeah, so it's kind of an opinionated tech stack. So if we were going to go and say, um, X large company, here's how you should uh, you know, deploy your containers, um, that would be on CoreOS Linux and using uh, etcd and Flannel and Kubernetes. Uh, and so we've kind of uh, built all that together, and uh, that's a product we call Tectonic. Um, so you get some support with that and architecture advice and that type of thing, and then uh, kind of our opinionated stack on how you should uh, run this infrastructure. And you said you just launched it just last week, is that correct? Uh, yeah, we've had a preview running for a while. Um, we just reached uh, general availability last Tuesday, um, and so we're really excited to help uh, customers, you know, get up and going with containers and Kubernetes. And so you also got your big show coming up in about three weeks in New York. Yeah, the what's, what's, Summit. Yeah, what's the focus of that? Um, that's more on the business side of this whole thing. So how do you, uh, you know, the business case around getting a way better efficiency or, uh, you know, moving either to the cloud or from the cloud or hybrid environments and uh, kind of the end-to-end -end life cycle of I have a development team, how do they build containers, how do they store them, how do they secure them, how do they deploy them. Um, and, but on the business side, so how do you, you know, all this costs money, so how do you, uh, how do you make this work uh, from a, you know, monetary standpoint? Cool. And then just to end with, where do you see uh, Tectonic, CoreOS, Rocket, et cetera, going in the next year or so? Um, I think we're going to continue to build out more platforms um, and then, you know, continue shipping uh, Kubernetes releases as soon as they come out um, and kind of stay on all the, the major features there. Um, and then just build in some, the, some of the stuff that you need to kind of power a business platform. So that's um, identity management and uh, we ship our container registry on cluster and that type of stuff. Um, kind of the tools that you need to actually make this pipeline work um, and deploy this infrastructure, debug it. That type of thing. Awesome. Rob yeah. Sumsky, thanks so much. Absolutely.